Okay, so now we're going to talk about some of the appliances in the trailer. We're going to turn on the propane. Propane is going to work your heater, your stove, um, your hot water heater. So the heater for the trailer as well as the hot water heater and your stove. First thing you want to do, uh, you can use either one. But if you look inside here, there's a knob. Right down over here, it's an indicator knob. It'll actually tell you which propane tank is on. It's pointing this way, so we're gonna turn this one on. If at any point during your trip, you're gonna run out of propane in one tank, you can take this white knob in here, turn it. And see, there'll be a little knob that comes that way. So now it would be on the other tank. For now, we're gonna leave it on that one. Make sure it's all the way turned. Go ahead and shut that. So now we're gonna come inside. The way we're gonna, we'll call it purge the propane out of the lines. And this should be the first thing you do before you turn on the fridge, before you try to run the heater, is we're gonna use the stove to purge the lines. So I would turn all three to light. You can hear the gas. And now, this is your igniter switch. Now all three are lit. So that's how you know that your gas lines are fully purged. So you have that. So the refrigerator could also run on propane. Um, it's a dual feed unit. You can see right up here, here's gonna be your on off button, your gas button. You always want the gas to be on auto, which will then automatically switch between gas and electric, depending on what you're hooked up to. It's always gonna to go to electric first, but as soon as you unplug from electric, it's gonna switch to gas. So you're gonna turn your refrigerator on. You want the button on the right to be on auto. If there were to be an issue, this check light would come on. You can actually hear the ticking now, it's lighting the propane. The check light would come on, meaning check. Uh, it could be out of propane, something like that. Uh, once you make sure that your propane is on, I've purged the system. You could, I would just cycle the on and off button, turn it off, give it a few seconds, a minute or two maybe, and then uh, turn it back on. So we'll leave that going for a few seconds. Next thing we're gonna do over here, third, third gas item, is gonna be your water heater. So you're just gonna flip this switch, and that's gonna turn the water heater on. You're initially gonna see this fault you will actually hear the burner clicking and then it ignite. I'm gonna turn it off right now because we're not hooked up to water. And that'll be the three items that are connected to gas.